So what temperature yeah, is it supposed to be, the water? Yeah, it is 42 degrees. Okay. 42 degrees. Right? right now I think it's at 45. Right. And you can see them, they were going to It's 90 seconds. 15 minutes, yeah. Yeah, the pool is a real heat sink. It's not going to change the temperature easily. And the volume of the water is much bigger than the volume of the bacterial solutions. Still at 42? Yes, we are. Yay! We're going down. Uh oh. Oh no, you ran out of hot water. <laughs> it's okay. Got another 45 seconds to go. Right. You want someone to fill that up? Can someone fill this? Hot water from the kitchen? Yeah. It's, uh, it's yeah. a good Quickly. <laughs> oh no, we're at 41 and a half. No, no. Half. Oh, no. <laughs> 20 seconds left. Thank you. Thanks. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yay! Back to the ice. All right, that's it. They should be transformed. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Yes, yes we've done it. All right. So. Oh, it went to two minutes and then the Luria broth. All right. Broth. And what is the? Oh, that's to. That's just food. Okay, for the little guys. Nice, nice, happy food. Okay. It's been heat shock and sort of very unhappy. So it's making them happy. Food. So you're gonna feed them to make them feel better. Yeah. Close this down good and put it at room temperature for five to fifteen minute recovery. So I'm just going to set it in here. So these are the beads inside. It's like this game, so if you have to put the bead in the right. Negative side's all yours. Okay. Um, Can we get rid of 
these? But no, I said, yeah. What are these? These are the bacterial stocks that we just did. Get rid of them. So now we've cleared all of the bacteria off of this table except for what's on these plates. And none of these things. So do you want to say contaminated? Do you want to tell us again um, what's the negative and what's the positive? Okay, for the video. So the, the the positive means that when we did the transformation, we actually put some of the plasmid in. The plasmid contains an ampicillin resistance gene and the gene for green fluorescent protein. The negative went through the same transformation procedure, the shock and everything, except there was no plasmid in there. And the two different types of plates, these two plates have ampicillin on them, and this one doesn't. Does anyone want to hazard a guess as to what we're going to see based on the characteristics of the plasmid? Somebody who's not a biologist. So, Song, what, Song, what do you think would happen when we plate the bacteria without the plasmid onto the ampicillin plate? Right. So we should see nothing on that. And obviously what's going to happen when we look at the plate with ampicillin that has the bacteria with the plasmid? Hopefully they'll blow. Yes. And the plate that doesn't have the selecting media, the ampicillin, this is a little this is a little bit of a trick question. <laughs> what do you think you'll see with the negative side? The side that has the bacteria with no plasmid in it. What what are we gonna see on regular media with no ampicillin? Um the E. coli will be able to survive, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That point. And now this is the trick question. What happens on the minus the, the side that does have the plasmid? It will still live and glow, I guess. But then, wasn't one of the things you said <laughs> that the regular E. coli will actually kind of overrun the ones with the plasmids? Exactly. So what's going to happen is there's going to be a few that might be colonies that are glowing, but they're going to have a really hard time because the other E. coli are going to beat the crap out of them and fight for the nutrients on that plate. So you probably won't see any green colonies on that plate. I mean, you might see one or something, but I really don't know what's going to happen, but it's, it's going to be at a disadvantage. So um, you might even see less colonies on that plate in general, depending on, on how many uh, transfectants we got. So that's what we should see on these plates in a couple of days. That's it. That's the end.